Good evening, everyone. My name is Heath Haskins, Code Primate, and this is Lumber Tycoon Two. Hello, everyone. So, um, a long time ago, like back whenever the the um, hatches hatch, it's a hatch, right? Yeah. Back when the hatches first came out. Well, hello, hello, test, test. <clears throat> back whenever the hatches first came out, um, I had discovered that um, wood that was on flat stuff would not react to it. Like, it doesn't do anything. So, you get a lot of stuff that gets stuck. Well, playing around with this thing, like I was cleaning up my base a little bit, and then all of a sudden I discovered that if you place this on like an incline, I was like, what happens if you have it on an incline instead? So, uh, da -da -da -da. let's grab this, check this out. This is actually really cool. Like, I'm very glad I discovered this. It hits, boink, stops, and if you hit it, it keeps going. <gasps> what? So the hatch, when used on an incline, will work correctly. Stops, and a go. Go. And then if the hatch is just down, it doesn't actually get stuck either. So, <clears throat> Something that you might try for your automation saws or stuff like that that have been breaking and you need hatches to stop them. Take your hatch, turn it like this underneath the, uh, the incline. Ooh, I wonder if it works on declines as well. Uh, let's go direction, 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 direction. Fine, that's good. Let's try the, uh, the opposite, opposite way. I was going to build on some... Uh, some awesome doors tonight. All right. Down, 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 down. Stops. Click. And the down decline works as well. Nice. So, back that direction. Back that way. Like, it even works better than the directions. Because the directions will still get you stuck. But the hatches on inclines will not. Wait, can I... Flip this, flip this. Nope, gotta touch it. There it goes. Boink. Let it sit there for just a second. La di da di da, time goes by. We're not doing anything and come back to it. And click. Boom, off she goes. So, new discovery, Um, I don't know what in the world? <laughs> okay, that was cool. Hold on, can I do that again? All right, get back. No, I ruined it. <laughs> that was cool. Okay, so some weird physics going on. Anyhow, thank you everyone for all the likes and comments and subs and everything that you guys did for the last video with uh, me and Mummy and the the hitch glitch, the the wagon glitch trailer glitch whatever you want to call it I mean there's not really a tag for it as far as I know um, anyhow that was really amazing like you guys whew, within like the first hour there's 500 views and that's that was a lot of views for me for uh, the first hour it's crazy like awesome crazy okay um we need to open this door Move this door and put it back. Now we should be able to build on that side, but in order to do so, we're going to have to open up this side. Ooh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Spaghettios. All right, hold on. And let's go open this top door right here. Open, there we go. <clears throat> if the top door opens and then we Move this door. No, that does not work. What in the world? Why is that not working? I guess I could just lower the whole thing. I mean, that'll work. So, there we go. <laughs> Get it out of the way. And then we'll start building on top of those. I think. I think that will work. It might still register as, like... Hmm. 
I don't know. We'll have to check. <coughs> and I'll check it real quick. This is also why I didn't want to um, jump like I, I didn't want the doors to all be built at one time or have them all closed. Like I want them to be built level at all times. That way I'd only have to open up the like the second level of doors and then the first level I could start building on right away. But if this attaches correctly and if I can get it in the right spot then I'm good. It'll be fine. No, it's it's still registering that door right there, isn't it? Oh gosh. Oh golly. No, maybe. Oh, oh hold on. Maybe I'm just not angled. Oh, oh Come on. Nope. <clears throat> it's still server registering the uh, the other door. Well. Hmm. Well, at least I can look around for spookwood. Any spookwood around anywhere? No? Nothing? I don't see nothing. Nothing. What about up there on top? See anything up there? Nope. <laughs> Nowhere to be found. And we've looked all around. <gasps> no, 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 no. Don't fall all the way down. I'm a rhyming clown. Just kidding. Alright. Alright, so we'll, we'll turn off this. And now we'll have to lift all the doors again. Lift these back up, put them in place. <clears throat> Good. Good. Very well. And up we go. So for those of you that are just now joining me, um, if you've never seen any of my videos before, I got a ton of awesome Lumber Tycoon 2 Roblox videos. Uh, I also have an entire series where I played like some original Nintendo games from the Wizard series. Um, the Wizard was like an awesome video game movie back in the day. Oh, that says closed door. I know, I went to open door. Open door. Open door. Open, 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 and open, and then we can a move, and B. There we go. So all those will chain react to the one that I was on. Boink. Now I should be able to move this in. There we are. Yes. Glorious. Wait, is that the right door? No, that's not the right door. Oh, man. Oh, I, ju I just about messed up like big time. Ooh, oh, no, 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 no. Okay, now I've messed up hugely. Huge mistake code. Why? Because I want to. I wanted to mess up. It's on purpose. It's totally on purpose. I guess I could just use the doors as the platforms instead. That way I would have doors to stand on. Go that direction. I guess I don't really need the chat on right now. Um, for those of you asking, yes, I am in a private server. Oh, why is it not going to that last one, please? I can't see it from the side. Can I move up like this? Nope. Hmm. Wheel. Get in there. Nope. Hmm. 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 Okay. So I will do this. Don't ask. I just know how. Okay. There we go. So now, haha. -ha, just get on there like that. No, like that. No. That's not. Rotate, rotate, turn, turn. Uh, turn, turn again. No. Uh, turn, turn one more time. Rotate, rotate. There we are. And it's going to open the wrong way. That's okay. Because we can... We can grab it like that. And like that. Good. Sweet. And down we go. Uh, grab this door. Give me door, please. Thank you. 
I'm thanking you. Open. And move. I can't, I can't even see up there. Maybe I should build from the opposite side. Should I put a second set of ladders, you think? Oh, maybe. I don't even remember why I was building up that high in the first place. Wait, was that? No! I'm one off. You can tell because the handles are not even. All right. <clears throat> <clears throat> Time for them jumping skills again. I really should make another platform up there. There we go. Oh, no, 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 no. I almost fell down. There we go. And come here, come here, come here. Move. There. Haha. <laughs> go one more up. And one down. Ooh. There. Perfect. Sweet. Sweet. Glorious. That's what I'm talking about. Perfect. Okay. Let's go and grab some more platforms. Do I, do I have platforms? I think I've got platforms somewhere. Did I put platforms underneath here? Yeah. No, those are floors. I don't want floor tiles. I want platforms. Like platform shoes. I gotta go do some disco dancing. Platform. I, I don't know from experience. I know my dad had disco shoes or boots or something. He's from the 60s and 70s. Cabinets, cabinets. No. No. Hmm. All right, let's grab this cherry wood one right here. And we're going to use our epic power. Didn't already have cherry. I did already have cherry. All right, come on, cherry wood. Let's do this. I'm going to go four because that's out of order. All right, hold on. Let's put four to number two. No, that's not what I want. There. Ah, just get on the bang there. <clears throat> and we'll go to floors. We're going to go to floor floors. No, not that floor. B. I'm going to go to two. We need the large floor tile. That's one. Sweet. Place that right there. One, two. Three, B. Now I should only need just one unit, right? Uh, okay, that's a little bit bigger than one unit, but that'll work. One. It's like creative mode is so cool. Two. I've got the power. And three. I guess I guess I am chopping a little bit more than one, but that's okay. We'll just move these out the way. In fact, we're going to toss them up there on our first platform. So I can grab them later. Look down at the ground. Look up at the sky. And good. That's special. That's perfect. <clears throat> come on, come on. Come on, please. There we go. It's not... Allowing me to build. Why? There we are. Good. Wait, did it build? Where did it go? Seriously? Okay, there was an autosave in there somewhere. Du -du 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 -du. Oh, by the way, um, if you press F9, you can see the server functions. It looks like the, the game GUI sounds did not load correctly. Um, by the way, we found out from this screen, F9, that the sounds are in replicated storage regions music. Oh, wait, that one's in uh, Code Primate Client Sounds dot store underscore cars failed to load. Hmm. So there's a couple of fails. Defaultio, if you wanted to see those in there. They're right there for you. I don't know why I'd need to see him. He's busy. He's been busy, busy programming some awesomeness. Which I can't wait to see the new programs coming out or the new uh, the new games. 
I'm so ready to play. All right, let's go ahead and grab this one. Oh, it did it did come down there. See that? It's got two. It's got a double. Double, double, boil in trouble. All right, can I build anywhere up here? Ooh, there we go. We'll just build on top of that. Then give me this. Come here, come here, come here. Move. I shouldn't have to move. Look down at the ground. There you go. Come on, get off of there. Get off of there. Why are you done? Yeah. Meh. There's that. And. Move. Oh my goodness. Please. And then what you'll have to do is you'll have to jump out to it. Move. I don't think these platforms are going to go all the way across, are they? Yeah, that's not close enough for the other one. So let's go grab a fourth one, just for fun. Do -do 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 -do. Uh, oh gosh, I'm stuck. If you ever get stuck in a menu zoomed in like this, and you're like, oh no, I can't get out, just press the O key. And you'll be okay. The okay to okay. Okay, okay. Okay? Okay. There's that. Boom. And beep. And one of these. By the way, this is like conserving so much wood. <clears throat> go, buddy, go. And then we'll just we'll just run up with this one. Why not? We've got plenty of time. Plenty of time. Well, not really a lot of time, but we do have time tonight. <sighs> um, by the way, to the person that suggests the idea of taking all the presents and placing them into a um, storage slot, like uh, Samper Life, go put it on like his fourth base or something like that. That is a brilliant idea. Um, only thing is I'm not gonna play both characters at the same time. Well, actually, I, I guess I could, but I don't I don't know. That, um, another idea is that the objects themselves are currently physical, like they're they're trying to move. If you place each object individually by itself out and away from the other objects, then the physics should have them just sit on something. So if I build up storage units on my base for each item, they should stop being moved around in physical and just stay in place. So either way, I, I, I want to build. And now that I've got the power, I'm going to build. But what I build will be completely and utterly random. I'm just kidding, I don't know yet. I don't know what I'm going to build, but it's going to be awesome. All right, should I start? Can I move that ladder? Oh, I can't move that ladder, oh no. Oh, no, 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 oh man, come on, seriously. Where's Control Z, where's the undo button? Can I undo that? I didn't want to fall down right there. All right, climb, 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 climb. By the way, those like that one and that one right below it, those are upside down ladders. That's why the gap looked differently. Somebody asked, I think I might have asked, I've been like, why are those different right there? And that's because they are like one of them's turned upside down or 90 degrees, not 90 degrees, 180 degrees. Rotated. Wait, what have I done? <laughs> I need doors. Just got so used to climbing up. Just keep going. Oh, really? All right, let's try it. You know what? I'm not gonna mess with that. I'm going to mess with the doors. Come here, doors. Wait, come here, doors. Get up there, doors. There's one. Move. Two. Move. Come here, come here. Move. Oh, come here, dude. Three. I'm just a moving some doors. Yeah, I'm moving along. You'll forget about me once you. I don't know. That's a that's a old song. 
Let's sing something new. Um, what's a new song? Hmm. Most of the new songs are like, I can't even sing. Somebody asked me to sing Despacito the other day and I'm like, have you translated those words? I can't sing that. That is, I mean, I know it's on radio, but parents, if your children are, are singing Despacito, go look up the translation real quick. <clears throat> mm-hmm. Just saying. My, uh, my wife said, I like this song. I'm like, you know why I don't let the kids listen to it, right? She's like, uh, no, why? I'm like, have you looked up the translation? So we were driving in the car, and she was letting the song just blast and play and go along. And, <laughs> like, <laughs> she started going through the lyrics, and she stopped reading them out loud real quick. <laughs> I'm like, mm-hmm, yeah. <laughs> so, I mean, it's a, it's a love song. That's what it is. It's, it's about love, and it's, that's good. Songs about love are good. Hmm. So that's my opinion on Despacito. Justin Bieber is a good, good singer. I think. Don't quote me on that. Like. <laughs> All right. Uh, oh, somebody asked me what my favorite kind of music was. And the answer is techno. I love techno dance music mashups kind of things. Like anything with a <laughs> that's kind of the beat that I like. So, and if this is your first time watching, um, I don't edit. I know there's a lot of people asking, you should edit and do this and that. And I'm like, haven't done that in over a year. I mean, there's every once in a while, I'll throw in some edits because I have to. But for the most part, my gameplays are straight through. Why? Because I think it's like, <clears throat> I feel it's kind of cheating you the full experience of the gameplay if you don't see the whole gameplay. Like I love, I love watching gameplays, but it just seems really <clears throat> incomplete. Like I just spent 15 minutes with you and you completed an entire level that takes me almost an hour to do. Like what happened or the round itself takes forever. And this person was like, oh yeah, I'm MLG, I'm the best. And I didn't even get to see the whole thing. I just got to see like the highlights, which the highlights, um, if you guys didn't know, highlighting came from sports and it was so you didn't have to sit through the whole game and you got to see the highlights of the game. Um, this was with football, baseball, stuff like that. And I just, I find that very going back to TV. I mean, if I wanted to see the highlights of a gameplay, I'd, I'd watch the TV. No, why did I, I fell down. And you wouldn't get to see these kind of struggles where I'm falling down all the time. Chop, chop. Anyhow. <laughs> and I also do 30 minute gameplays, so... Instead of uh, instead of having like 15 minutes or 11 minutes of a edited section, just to make sure I get the 10 minutes for the monetization, I give you a full 30 minutes and then put the monetization at like every 10 to 15 minutes, something like that. My average is about five ads per video. So five ads in 30 minutes, four to five ads. And uh, sometimes it does get more than that, but that's usually because like I record over time. Like I, I have 45 minute videos sometimes. And that's just because I, I like to play. I mean, this is what I was going to do, be doing anyway. Might as well record it for you guys and let you see what I was doing, right? Right, and that's how I feel. I don't know if everybody feels that way and you might not feel that way. And that's fine. You don't have to agree with me. You are entitled to your opinion at any time. But if it wasn't enjoyable in some manner, you wouldn't be here and you wouldn't still be watching. So thank you for staying. I love you.
Boom. Yes. That was glorious. And, oh wait, I have to set this down first. And then we open the door. And then we grab. And then we move. And now we move. Come on. Come on. It's always easier to just drop it in right here at the top. Whoa. Whoa. Go down one. Down one. Nope. Down one. Oh, not two. There. Is that even? Even! Good. Tom! Yes! Yes, Code. Tom, what are you doing? Just tending to my shop, sir. Tom, he runs the wood store down there. He's an amazing guy. I mean, he, he deals in, in blueprints and sawmills and all kinds of good stuff. All the time. I like checking in on him because, you know, I think he gets lonely sometimes. But only, only in Lumberland does that ever happen. He's a good guy. And it doesn't matter, like, I know I switch servers a lot. Doesn't matter what server I'm in, he's always there. So I think, I think he follows me. It's like my own special attendant for the lumber store. Wood RS store. Are those all even? Oh, they are. That was a good job, Code. Good job. Let's go ahead and go two more up this direction. One. Yeah. Why not three? We could do three. Three is easy. One. Two. And three. Oh, no, 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 no. Get in there. Good. Go three on this side and three on the other side, and then I'll call it quits for tonight. Because I think we have done a good job. And for the most part, I, I really wanted to show you guys the hatch. I mean, that was the point. Oh, and to the person that said, Code, you've made the point of your, your palm wood bridge pointless. Um, okay. That's not true. Uh, the, the trailer glitch does not replace the palm wood bridge because with the trailer glitch, how are you supposed to get the wood back? There. So the, the point of the palm wood bridge is still very valid and I still very, feel very happy that I have the bridge and it's still very tall <laughs> because it's a long way to palm. Like, it looks like it's right there, but it's really, like, that's how far away it is. All the way down. You have to walk that whole thing just to get there. Crazy. Alright, and let's go a little bit more on this other slide. Other slide! <laughs> Alright, so, we're going to go move. We're going to go rotate, rotate, turn, turn. Okay. Once you once you find the, the locking mechanism for the door... The, the thing that makes them attach to each other, then, I mean, it's easy to get the rotations. It's always rotate, rotate, turn, turn for the opposite side. If you're doing double doors. If you're not doing double doors, don't rotate or turn at all. Just leave it the way it is. We've got three more. One, two, three. Yep, yeah, three. Good. Here we go. Here we go. We're so close. I'm thinking about just trying to keep the video going and we'll go as far as we can. Because, I mean, we are really close. Is that even? That's even. Good. <clears throat> come on, come on, come on. Right there? Is that right? Oh, man. Wait, is it sticking to the ladder? Don't stick to the ladder. Come on, come on. Not the ladder. I want you to, I want you to stick to the door, not the ladder. Okay, so it's going to be right. Oh man. Okay. Let's just go up here. There we are. One down. There it goes. Good. Good. Thought I was stuck there for a second. And I know that you, like, 
I see the door. Like here, I'll show you what I mean. You see where the door is, right? But you really have to treat it like a, like a piece of wood. See how it switches? But that big rectangle in the middle, that's, that's what you're shooting for. Not there. Whoa, come down one. Is that even? Even. Glorious even. Close, close, close. Close. Oops. There we are. Close. Why are you not closing? You should be closed. Moved and closed. Good. Close the door. Close. Up. Move. B. Move. B. Close that door. Here we are. And move B closed. Move B closed. <laughs> I wonder if I'm, I'm going to have to go back up with all of them, aren't I? Maybe, maybe not. Hmm. Okay, we we might be okay. I'm gonna have to close this one. Or no, this one. Nope. Hmm. All right. <coughs> skills. Skills time. There we are. So let's just go ahead and move B. And move B. Close that door. Close that door. There we are. Whoa, 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 whoa. Is there some more doors open? More door. There we are. Okay. Move B. <gasps> no! No, what happened? Ooh, ooh. I can't shut that door. Okay. This is the open door. So that's not the one. Close that door. There we go. Move. B. That'll lock those in place. Oh gosh. About to fall down again. Move B. Move B. Close this door. Move. 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 There we go. Close. 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 There we go. Good, good, good. So good. Move B and oh, that one's that one says open. Well, all right then. Now let's see if it worked. All those doors attached. Nope, we missed some. What did I miss? How many did I miss? Oh gosh. We're almost there for the first part of the bridge. Oh, this is going to take forever, code. <sighs> For the most part, I mean, it's not that bad as far as building. It's just very time consuming. One, two, three. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. So if I go down here and I go move B. Hmm. There's only five. Okay. Let's lift that back up. Lift. We're not going to worry about the other one at the moment. We only have to worry about the fifth one down. What time is it? Oh, we're at 34 minutes. Oh my goodness. Taking forever. One, two, three, four. I can't remember if it was that one or the one below it. One, two, three, four. So let's just move all of them. Move that one. B. Move this one. B. And move the one below it. Why not? B. There we go. Sweet. So now let's go click. Bridge goes down. Oh, wait. Did I miss some? Oh, man. That doesn't matter. 
we'll go back and get them. We'll make sure that they're all squared away by the time this is done. Look at that. Look at that. So close. So uh, a way we can measure to see how far we need to go is we'll place the mouse. All right, we'll do even cuts. So the greater than less than symbols like this on your keyboard, they'll do exact turns at 45 degree angles. I know, everybody's getting dizzy. But if we place the mouse right here, all right, see how I'm, I'm right even with my character? And then I'm gonna hit this one, two, three, four, four times. Where it lands on the doors is the exact point of how many doors I need. So if we count from the arrow to my character, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Okay, so I need 16 more doors to get over there. That's doubled. 16 plus 16 is 32. So I'm going to need 32 plus the two doors that are missing. No, I'll only need 32 more doors to complete the first part of the bridge. How many did we put up tonight? Like seven? Wow. That's gonna, that's, it's. Anyhow, thank you all for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2 with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. And um, that's just a suggestion. You don't actually have to subscribe or like or comment. If you want to just watch, that's cool. I mean, 71% of all of my viewers right now are probably unsubscribed. You're just watching because it's Lumber Tycoon 2 and you think it's amazing anyway. And that's your choice. I love you guys very much. If you like one of those awesome t-shirts with my face on it, check out the Hello Juniper link in the description below. Also, I will leave a link to go and buy one of your rookie axes. Um, to the winners, I do have six of the nine addresses that won. If you have not claimed it yet, please email me. I'm, I've sent out the email to everyone that won and give me a second because I did not realize how expensive it's going to be to ship all these out to individual addresses to individual people. So I will get it to you. Give me a second. It's on the way. Love you guys very much. Have a great night and we'll talk to you very soon. Outro time. Outro. No, outro. Out. Outro? Outro. No, the outro is not working. I'm just kidding. Thank you.